Uh, taking back the community, a Newport News delegate championed a bill to train hotel staff and how to help victims of human trafficking. It is one of seven bills Governor Glenn Youngkin signed aimed at preventing human trafficking. Tittle on your side, Tiana Patterson is here to explain how this will work. Yes, Regina, well, unfortunately, human and sex trafficking is an issue here in Hampton Roads, but Newport News delegate Shelly Simons wants to change that. So she introduced a bill and it passed in both the House and the Senate. And just last week, the governor signed it into law. From check-in. We want to help them. To housekeeping. We want to make sure that everyone in the hotel business has this training. Liz Parker's worked in the hotel business for four decades and witnessed the horrors of modern slavery. I have seen unfortunate situations with human trafficking. I've had that happen to, you know, in our hotels. Now as the president of the Newport News Hospitality Association, she's an advocate for change. They'll leave this building, you know, not under their own, you know, free will. That really scares the dickens out of me because of how rampant it's become, especially in the Hampton Roads area. The region's Human Trafficking Task Force reports the number of human and sex trafficking cases in our area increased during the pandemic. We know that motels and hotels are places where um, this often happens. Newport News delegate Shelley Simons championed a bill to train all hotel and motel staff on the signs of trafficking. They don't just stay at a three-star or four-star hotel. They stay at a one-star or two-star hotel. The Department of Criminal Justice Services will create the class and training will be free. It needs to be for everyone. Everyone needs to be a part of it. Starting in January, all hotel staff will have to take the class within their first six months and at least once every two years. I believe that people do want to help their community. They want the training. They want to know what the protocol is. And you can help take back the community by looking for red flags of human trafficking. I'll post a list of those over on wavy.com. Kiana Patterson, 10 on your side.